Right, guys, welcome back to some more Fallout 3. Hope you're all all right. Now, quick karma check for anyone who's interested. Um, we are Peacekeeper. Good. I normally end up being on the good side of the karma. We've done six quests, 13 locations. Not too bad on the stats so far. We've had six speech successes. Disarmed 15 mines. Found a couple of bobbleheads. Five bucks red. Not too much else to write home about. Anyway, what should we do today? So we've got big trouble in big town, which is kind of quick. Uh, so I could go and do that. I've got to do that wasteland survival guide, and then we've got to go find GNR as well. So we could do big trouble in big town, and then go for GNR as well. Uh, which is easier to go German town. Might just go for a minefield. Now this place is super mutant infested. But I do have a hunting rifle. Trusty hunting rifle and a dog meat. There could be some around the outside of it to be honest. There was when I came the other direction. Um there was a couple of super mutants just kicking around. One had a minigun. Which I actually stole. Oh. Not a super mutant, but a blow fly. Come on, dog meat. Leave it alone. Here's Germantown. The police headquarters. Now, this place is pretty infested with super mutants, I will say that. I did not like coming here the first time I ever did this quest. Oh, fucking hell. I'm not going to lie, when I was like 13 year old playing this game for the first time, Duke mutants used to scare the shit out of me. start yeah, I'll take your frogs actually I can't remember if they've got centaurs with them as well I can see one behind that gate I should get a shot on him. Dogmate is not happy. something friendly over here and I'm not sure what it is. It's probably just an enclave I bought. Yeah, it is. That's not going to come in handy. I think, is it this Is it this door here to the left? If you have a hundred lockpick, you can literally just walk in here. Yep, I knew it. I knew it. So, because I don't have that, I've got to go the fucking hard way, which is through all of these super mutants. Oh, shit. Dog meat, look out. <laughs> Bitch. Well, the eyebot actually did try and help. Yep, there's a centaur. I knew there'd be some. <laughs> Ugh. 
windows are so disgusting. That was such a strange angle of my character. I did not like that. Thanks. Nancy Croydon. I don't think that's helping in any way. Get the bottle caps out of that gore bag. Oh, there must not be any enemies around because it's given me the option to sleep. So we might be all right here. It's inside where shit hits the fan. Now my question is, how the hell do you get in? Because I always used to use this door. What's the alternate way into Germantown Police Headquarters? Is it up there? Alright, maybe this door over here. Starting off on the second floor, or top floor. Oh, you are joking. Actually, hang on. Oh, dog meat, don't... I'm not going to risk it. I'm not going to risk it. If I throw a frag in there and kill dog meat, I will be raging. Actually, I also don't want dog meat to die, so... Leave him alone. Leave my dog alone, shithead. Come here, dog mate. I can't have you. Wait, why can't I heal him? Take your hunting rifle, actually. Can't do it. Uh, we'll keep it for now while I've got the space. The hostages are downstairs. Oh, fuck. It's just too quiet. That's exactly how I'm feeling right now. Oh, shit. I've just stepped on a mine. Ability carried. He cries? No. 
wanting. It's not going to be lurking. Red least three. Fuck off. Sending, right. That's a good start. Reading. Oh. Leading. Leading. It has to be leading. Nice. Don't need to disengage the lock. I just wanted the free XP. Alright, here we go. Shooting a rad roach. Oh, fuck. You're gonna tell me none of them heard that. Oh shit. Fuck's sake. 911. Yeah, I am not sounding the station alarm. I'm not that fucking stupid, thank you. Thanks, but no thanks. Now try and hide from that! Shit, problem is where they coming from. Oh, there he is. The brute and all. Dog me, go. Oh my god, he's doing like nothing to him. Oh my god, dog meat. Yes. Well in dog meat. Good boy. I was wanting to leave me health down for that uh the the quest I've got, but Another problem. I've still got to go down one more floor. Did that just miss? This isn't the door I'm thinking of. Of course, there's more bombs. Why wouldn't there be? Oh, yes, I get a silence. A silence 10 millimeter back after I got rid of that other one. All right, hold on a moment. Heal that up. I'll repair that, should I say. Go up Magnum. Right, I need 43 repair skill. Thing is, it doesn't really help. That's not helped me yet. Should I say? Railway spikes, nice. They'll come in handy. Bobby pin, even better.
I need a crippling injury. Well, I've got a crippling injury. Um, right, I need to get rid of some stuff. Rifle. I'm not actually not going to use it yet because I don't really have the. That Scorp Magnum is shit. Why am I even carrying that? The state of it. Right, I need rid of some shit. Baseball glove. I'll get rid of one camera. I'll get rid of a conductor. I'm carrying way too many of that shit. Right, well, we found our prisoner anyway. Quick, unlock the door. Oh, the game is chopping up not very well. Oh, shit. This isn't good. Oh, wait a minute, we might be all right. Yeah, it's stabilizing. All right, I'll get you out of there, Red. There you go. You're rescuing me? Thanks. I thought we were goners for sure. Well, I think the others are dead. Or worse. Me too. I'm extremely lucky you came along. Everyone else is dead. We're taken away to who knows where. Well, except maybe for Shorty. They dragged him off downstairs to the kitchen a while ago. But no one comes back from the kitchen. I'm not waiting around for some super mutant to lock me up again. There's a back door somewhere around here. If you're not back soon, I'm leaving without you. If I'm not here when you come back, meet me at Big Town. Might as well open these doors for the free XP as well. Right, time to go and save Shorty. Right, I love the blood trail. Let us know what I'm heading into. Grenades. Dog meat, stop it. You're making us more on edge than I need to be. You stupid bastard. Oh my god, I can't believe it. We got a fat man before we were supposed to get one. I forgot that was in here. Oh, that's crazy. That is actually crazy. Um, Right, in that case, I'm going to have to do some serious... Uh, oh my god, I can't believe I've got a fat man already. Right, 
Alright, time to get rid of the miscellaneous. Uh, I'm pretty sure I don't need all of these things. That'll do for now. Well, just coming down here and getting the fat man is a massive positive. Catch! I was hoping that might have lured some enemies out, but it didn't. Dog, mate, you've run in when I was going to chuck a frog. Now oh. drop. Go on, dog, mate, fuck him up. Dickie Nuka call a quantum there and all on the floor. Andy. Thanks. Who are you? Never mind, I don't care right now. Let's go get red and get out of here. You lead, I'll follow. Let's go. Move it. All right, move it. Right, let's go. You're not really in a position to be making orders, my friend. All right, let's get out of here. Right, we made it. Go get a big town now. Remember to keep an eye on the north. Our hero returns. Whew. I'm glad to be safely back home. Thank you. You're a real hero, you know that? I was going to offer you a reward, but I can put the caps to use buying medicine and supplies. Thanks. I know you've already risked your life once already, but I heard the mutants talking about another attack. They'll probably be here soon. Really? That's great. What do you have in mind? 
Great. Let's head over to the junkyard. There's some old robots in there. Maybe you can fix them up and we'll watch to see how it's done. Did he rescue them? Robot army in common. Feather sentry bot as well. I don't like it being so dark. That's better. Munis! The munis are coming! Oh shit, don't throw it at them. You're welcome, people of Big Town. We're still Thanks for helping us. I just hope we can survive another attack. Probably won't. Nice to have the optimism. There was a super mutant attack recently, and where there's one big ugly, there are ten more just waiting to grab you by the throat. Then the slavers will come and pick off what's left of your carcass and drag any survivors to Paradise Falls. Skulk up toward Germantown, near the police station. They always come from that direction. Nearby, slavers move quick and come from all directions. Someone else might know where they nest. There isn't anything here that hasn't been destroyed or dragged away. You're better off scavenging the dead out in the wasteland. Someone can give me the directions for Paradise Falls. We did it! You did it! You helped us defeat the mutants! Oh, we'll all feel safer now. Thank you so much. Is it you that tells me I where they are? I think I'm going to build a little shrine to you. All I need is some incense sticks and candles. Oh, yeah? What is it? Um, not that I care what you think. Really? I mean, <clears throat> good. No one wants to look like the boring slobs in this town anyway. Besides, if we're all going to die here, I at least want my corpse to look better than these inane wastelanders. You're not, um, seeing anyone right now, are you? This wasn't even the plan. I was trying to find out where Paradise Falls is. Yay! D we got those mutants good, didn't we? From the look of things, I'd say a super mutant sat down in a ditch one day and shat out this town. <laughs> I dragged myself here from Lamplight. I didn't believe all the stories about Big Town, but I wasn't about to let everyone else go there without me. A few dozen attacks on the town later, and here I am. Almost an ingredient in a super mutant chili cook-off. Lump lights crazy as well. I haven't here. slept in weeks. I'm starting to feel safe for the first time in a long time. Thanks to you. 
Oh, Little Lamplight is where most of us came from. Red and Pappy and Flash and Bittercup. We used to play together when we were kids. Then we got old and we had to leave. Those were the rules. So we packed up and headed here, like we were supposed to. No one told us it would be like this. We never have fun anymore. And most of us, most of us are dead. Thanks. Right, I'll find Paradise Falls myself. This place. I have an idea of where it's at, but that's not the plan anyway. We're going to go for GNR. So, we've got to go through the metro again. Get to worse off. So we'll go to GNR through the metro, but we've got to go to Super Duper Mart first. Because the entrance to the station's like just over the river. And I said it when I was here before, like literally over in that direction. It's the, the entrance is like just there. I'm sure there's super mutants over here though. There we go, Faragut West Metro Station. I'm sure that's it. Yeah, it's this one here. Alright, here we go. Have our first encounter with some feral ghouls. You're all right, dog me, chill out. None of that works. Oh, fuck. Well in dog me. I think I already got a lawn mower blade, but I'll just get another one just in case. Me, bitch. Plenty of conductors there. Should maybe make a mental note of that. Oh, there's the gate key as well. We don't do things that way, though. I like getting the XP for unlocking the doors and that. I don't need that. I'm just going to drink them for the crack. Oh, a vacuum cleaner. Is that uh, a component for crafting? I feel like it is. What I love about ghouls is that they normally always have bottle caps on them. These guys are literal treasure troves. Uh... Right, 
I've got enough. I don't need any of that stuff. I'm just going to keep ending up carrying, dropping, carrying, dropping, so I'm not going to do it. We'll make do with what we've got. Is where the fun begins. I've just realised because I drank that wine or whatever it was, it's given me a, a, a strength boost that I shouldn't have. That's going to wear off and then I'm going to be over encumbered again, which is not good. Oh, look, a fucking silver mutant. That was a ghoul fighting it. Lol. Oh, shit! Blat. Oh, fuck off. Now the mute, he had nothing. So the proper way out is that way. A bit confusing down here at times. All the metro stations are, can be confusing, to be honest. Pretty sure it is this way. Not over encumbered anymore. Chevy Chase, here we go. Nearly leveled up as well. Here's where we get our first glimpse of the Brotherhood. Oh, and I level up. Right, small guns is going up, lock picks going up. And science. I'm going to be able to get into terminals and stuff. I'm going to go for comprehension as well. We get an extra skill point now for every book that we read. Which is pretty nice. Oh, shit! The Brotherhood will come to be rescue. My God, how do you miss from there? That said it was a 60% chance, but come on. don't belong here. The super mutants have overrun our brothers at the Galaxy News radio building, and we're headed there to back them up. You can tag along if you want, 
but keep your head down and try not to do anything stupid. You've been living under a rock? This is DC. The entire city is crawling with super mutants. Now, if you'll excuse me. That's a negative. I can't wait till he puts super mutants in the TV show. Ready on me. There was a little teaser to one of them. Right at the beginning. But I like that they're being patient with it. See, there's not even any point in me picking up that power armor because, well, A, I can't wear it, and B, it's just going to take up a shitload of space. Five mutants released from their torment. The rest are keeping their heads down. Good. Jennings? Negative. A new recruit? Just a stray we picked up. The one that blundered into the uglies over on 42nd. Welcome. All right. It's the usual drill. Redden. You just do whatever Paladin Vargas says and keep your mouth shut. Yes, ma'am. All right, let's go, team. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Away from the car. Away from the car. Holy shit. These guys are just absolutely going through and tearing everything up. Oh my god, 18% chance. 18% chance in a dream! Nailed it. Me hunting rifle's getting a little bit low. Let me see if I can... Uh, Champion. That's better. Oh, you mate, don't just stand there. Frag. Dog mate, no. Well, he's still alive. Ugly's in our sight. Right, I'm taking that already preemptively because I know what's coming. Ammo. Ah, oh, come on. We just kicked their asses. We need to sweep the area. You think those were all the uglies in DC? You take the east side. I'll go west. We're clear out here. Okay, Stand down. Okay. I am so ready for what's about to come through here. Who else? Now you're Always count on my father to send the best. Let's just prepare. Don't do it. Don't do it. Oh, you silly fucker. Yeah. It's gonna fly right past it. Oh, that was such a waste of a mini nuke. I'm not firing another one. Oh my god. He's absolutely... No! Ooh. 
Oh my god. No, I can't, guys. I can't. I can't. That was brutal. E2 bang dog meat. That was that was awful. All right, attempt number two at this super mutant behemoth. I've had to make dog meat stay in there, out of the way. Oh, shit. Catch this, bitch. Oh, my God. Look at that aim. That was still better than me last nuke. That was so much better. Get the we'll try to that was actually an incredible effort. Whee. Right, dog mate, you can come back now. I just wanted you to be safe. Where did I leave him? I can hear him barking. A panting, sorry. There he is. I just wanted you to be safe. Let's see if they've got anything to drink in this dump. Plenty down, like. A few casualties. Looks like it's all clear. Unlocking outer doors. Galaxy News Radio and listen. It's the only radio station in the Capital Wasteland that really tells it like it is. You can head right on up. He's waiting for you. Just stay out of our way and everything will be fine. Knight Finley at your service. What can I do for you? This is Galaxy News Radio. The last free voice of the people of the Wasteland. The Brotherhood of Steel makes sure of that. Three dog is right upstairs. Okay, just make sure not to interfere with our operations. I won't, don't you worry. Look on your face says it all. You're wondering who the heck this guy is and why you should care. Well, prepare to be enlightened. I am Three Dog, jockey of discs and teller of truths, lord and master over the finest radio station to grace the wastes, Galaxy News Radio. And you, well, I know who you are. Heard about you leaving that vault, traveling the unknown, just like dear old dad, huh? Met him already. Hey, when you're in the good fight, you gotta give it all you got and never ever hold back. Always dazzle them, I always say. Always dazzle them and spread the word. Imagine a picture, okay? A picture of the capital wasteland. All that brick and rock. A whole lot of nothing, right? There's people out there trying to just barely make it from day to day, fighting to stay alive and make something out of what they got. But then you've got all kinds of shit. Slavers, super mutants, raiders. They all want a slice of the pie, too, and aim to take it by force. Well, holy shit. Aren't you a chip off the old block? You are as smart as your dad. Since you know all about this cause, no need to explain the effect. Let's get you on your way. Oh, come on. You're a spitting image of the guy. He's been here before, and now you're here. Doesn't take a genius to figure it out. You want to find your dad. And it just so happens his location is known to yours truly. But if you want to know more, you're going to have to contribute to the good fight. You want to find your dad. 
and it just so happens his location is known to yours truly. He was here at Galaxy News. We had a great conversation. He's a real stand-up guy. If you want to know more, you're going to have to contribute to the good fight. Well, your dad is some sort of scientist type, some kind of egghead or something. You really think if you find him, he'd help our cause? When your dad passed through here, I spent a good long time talking to him about all kinds of stuff. He mentioned some scientific mumbo-jumbo, which didn't make much sense to me. Hmm. Something about a Project Purity. He also said something about going to visit a Dr. Lee in Rivet City. Then, he left in a hurry. You've never heard of Rivet City? Wow. Just... Wow. Well, a whole bunch of eggheads got together and turned a beached aircraft carrier into a town. <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? Just follow the river south from here. There's no way you can miss it. And there we go. There's the Galaxy News radio done. Following in his footsteps, we've got to go to Rivet City. I do like Rivet City. Cool place. We're on to scientific pursuits. So we got to get all the way down here. And you can actually, like, go through the metro. I think, yeah, I'm sure you can also just run down. I swear I've, like, run down to Rivet City before. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I did go through the metro. I don't know. Anyway, that is next video's problem. Now, our vodka's just worn off. Good timing. So now we can't carry as much as we could. We're back to normal again, but it's all right because we're still under. So that's good. Um, we've already got our fat man. And, we, well, we had two, so we've repaired it. We've, now we've got an even better one, which is great. And we got eight nukes in it as well. I'm just really enjoying playing this game again. I don't even, like... This is, this is the reason this game is one of the reasons, anyway, I should say, is why... When people, like, complain about graphics and things, like, I could not give a shit. This game looks terrible. Like, I'll be the first to admit that it looks absolutely terrible, but... I mean, for its age, yeah. But... It doesn't look great. But... It's a great game regardless. So... Yeah, I never, uh, I never buy into that graphics equals quality argument. If a game's good, a game's good. Simple as that. But anyway, that's a whole nother conversation and I'll end up waffling on for ages, guys. So I am going to leave it there for now. If you have made it this far, thank you so much for watching. As always, I really do appreciate it. If you wouldn't mind dropping a like on the video and subscribing to the channel if you're new around here as well, it'd really help us out a lot. But other than that, I hope wherever you all are, you are having a wonderful day and I'll see you on the next one. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.